Okay guys, today I'm going to show you how to create groups and s sort of subgroups in EndNote so you can uh, classify your research based on any objectives or any different projects you have. So, first here you have usually whenever you first, you first install EndNote, I have EndNote X7, uh, you'll get just this one which is called My Groups and then what we usually would do is create groups here by this way like right click and then create group but then you cannot create subgroups here right you can delete but not more than that so what you can do is create group sets and then you have just two levels of, of group like group sets and then grouping within the group sets so I'm gonna create one group set so whenever I create a group set Let's call this group set. I'm working with a uh, let's call it Asper A flowers. Okay, so this is a group set. So here you can create a group which might be called transcriptal analysis then I have here one project I'm working with and then I can create a, a group here well I can delete this group and then I can create a group here called genome sequence or genome annotation let's call it and then I create here another group called genome assembly So I have group and subgrouping for this project, group and subgrouping for this project, and then this is just my groups. I can delete this one. So it doesn't. And then I have just these groups. Then you can continue creating groups and then you add just from here you just add this like this way, okay? And then you'll you'll have your papers there. That was all.